Hello everyone. In this video session, I am going to explain part 157 of Java for Tester series, that is hierarchical inheritance. In Java, there are different types of inheritance. They are single inheritance, multiple inheritance, multi level inheritance, hierarchical inheritance, and hybrid inheritance. These are the different types of inheritance we have in Java. And in the current video session, I'm going to practically demonstrate how to implement the fourth type of inheritance that is hierarchical inheritance. So what is this hierarchical inheritance? What is this hierarchical inheritance? So if I have to represent, represent this hierarchical inheritance in a diagrammatical format, it will look something like this, guys. Okay? Hierarchical inheritance will some look something like this when I represent in a diagrammatical way. So here, let's say this is class A. This is class B. This is class C. This is class D. Fine. So here, class B is extending class A, that is class B is inheriting the properties of the class A. Same time, class C, another class, class is also inheriting the same class, class A, okay? And class D is also inheriting or extending the properties of the class A. So here, multiple classes are inheriting the properties of a single class known as class A. Is this possible, guys? The answer is yes, guys, it is possible, okay? Multiple classes can inherit the properties of a single class that is possible in Java. Let me show you practically, guys. So let's create a class known as class A, finish. And in this class A, I will give some properties like int x, public void, some method x, okay, some properties that is variables and methods. I'm just giving, okay, method x. That's fine. Now, guys, I will create other classes new class b finish okay class b now i will create another class class c i just drag it here so that you can see all the classes at the same time okay class c then i'll create another class that is class D. Like this, I can create multiple classes, guys. Okay, I can create multiple classes like this. Class A, class B, class C, class D. Okay, here I can make, according to the diagram, as you can see here, class B can extend class A, right? Class B extends class A. Class C extends class A. Okay, class B is extending the same class known as class A. And class C is also extending the same class known as class A. I'm not getting any compiler errors, guys. Java is allowing me to do so. And here, I'm also trying to extend class A by class D, okay? Class D will also extend class A. Class D extends class A. You see here, multiple classes, that is class B, class C, class D, are extending the same class, that is class A. And we are not getting any compiler errors. That means Java is allowing you to Java is allowing you to extend, that is allowing multiple classes to extend a single class. That is, Java is allowing multiple classes to inherit the properties of a single class. And that is possible in Java, guys, because we are not getting any compiler errors here. So guys, hierarchical inheritance is, that's how possible in Java, guys. So that's it, guys. In the next video session, I'll explain the next type of inheritance that is hybrid inheritance the last type of inheritance guys that i'm going to explain that is hybrid inheritance i'm going to practically demonstrate whether hybrid inheritance is possible or not in java in the next video session guys so that's it guys see you in the next video session thank you bye